Okay, I've been instructed to basically do a vlog, um, basically, uh, about hitting guys in the nuts, um, and why it's so funny. I have, um, uh, six questions that were asked to me that I'm going to answer, uh, in an email on YouTube by, uh, someone, and, um, I'm sure he'll make himself known, or herself, actually, I guess, it, I'm assuming it's a guy, um, hey, uh, 1029. Anyways, um, if I said that right. Anyways, um, the questions are, um, one, have you ever hit a guy in the nuts before? Uh, no, I've never actually, uh, hit, like, straight up hit a guy in the nuts. Um, I tried to knee a guy in the nuts once, but, um, I wasn't quick enough, and, uh, he kind of grabbed me and, well, it was embarrassing. He flipped me and... Uh, I ended up making myself look like an ass, but it pissed me off, so, um, but I have popped a guy in the nuts. Uh, I've done this to a couple people, and more specifically my ex-husband. Um, whenever he would piss me off, I would pop him in the nuts. I wouldn't hit him, but I just, like, flick, it's like a flick or, or like I just pop real fast, real, you know, real hard, real quick, and that seems to work um, pretty well. Uh, the second question is, if you have, uh, why'd you do it? And, um, tell your stories about it. Uh, okay, well, every girl knows that a guy's weakest spot is his balls. Everybody knows that. All girls know that. If you want to hurt a guy, obviously you can't walk up to a guy, you know, 130 pounds of you, walk up to a fucking 200 pound guy and punch him. It's not going to happen. You can't kick a guy's ass. Um, unless he's teeny tiny, which, that's besides the point. Um, well, a guy's balls is his weak spot, and so that's our advantage. Uh, it's not fair when you're mad at a guy. Girl, women are more physical as far as... We're, we're violent towards men, like you see you see women when they're angry at guys, they hit them, but that doesn't do anything to them, so you hit them in the balls, or you pop them in the balls, or you flick them in the balls, or whatever you want to do, but that's their weak spot, they can't help it. Um, so, uh, I can't really think of anything that sticks out, mostly just all the stuff I did to my ex-husband, when he wasn't looking, I would flick him or pop him in the balls, and, um, he used to tell me that um, he used to tell me that that hurt just as much as if you were to get kicked in the balls, which I think that's kind of crazy. But whenever I did it, he would always make a noise like he was gonna either throw up or he would kind of go like I, I would I would flick him or I would pop him, and he would jump and he would go and he would his eyes would kind of roll into the back of his head, so so he wouldn't be looking and he, and I'd be all pissed off at him and he'd look away and I'd be like pop and he'd like. <laughs> and then, um, and then, uh, I got my revenge, and sometimes I did it again when he wasn't looking, like, like, a, a minute or two later, he wouldn't be looking, and I'd do it again. He eventually learned from that, but it worked, and it made me feel better. Uh, why is hitting guys in the balls so funny? It's funny because they look like such pussies when we hit them in the balls. It's, it's, that's their, like, their balls might as well be their pussy, seriously, like, <laughs> a guy can be the biggest, toughest badass in the whole world, but you hit him in the fucking balls, and he's a pussy. He's down on the floor, and he's crying, and he's, <gasps> because you guys can't help it, when they get hit in the balls, they're out, they're fucking down, they're, they're done, you know, fucking pack them up and send them home put a fork in them because they're done. <laughs> um, uh, okay, uh, when have you seen it happen? Oh, jeez. Sad to say, I don't think that I've ever seen some Well, I saw a girl once when I was in the army. A girl came up to a, to a guy that she knew in the army and, and she straight up just whacked him in the nuts. And he literally fell down um, on his knees. He didn't fall all the way down, and I don't think she did it hard enough. I almost wanted to do it again for her because I was kind of pissed off she didn't do it hard enough. But he kind of fell down, and he was all like, ah. <laughs> So that was funny. Um, 
If you were going to hurt a guy's balls, what's your favorite or funniest way to do it? Um, really, my favorite my favorite way to do it is to pop them or flick them because you can get real close and you can do it pretty hard with just your hand. You don't have to straight up hit them in the nuts or knee them in the nuts. Um, you can if you come up to a guy's balls and you straight up just pop, flick them in their nuts. That shit will hurt, ladies, and I think fellas know this too. Just imagine your balls hanging there, all tender, you know, full of babies. And some girl walks up, and she just pop or pop. Wouldn't feel good at all. Mm -mm. Um, I've always wanted to actually knee a guy in the nuts before, like you see on the movies. It's not that easy though because they're quicker. They don't. They they see it coming when you do it that way, and then you know your aim is off. But I've always wanted to just walk up to a guy and grab him by the shoulders and knee him in the nuts. That would be so awesome. Definitely. Um, so maybe one day, maybe one day I'll just walk up to a guy and just knee him right in the crotch. Right in the baby maker. Um, how did you learn about guys' balls and how easy it is to hurt them? Okay, well, number one, my dad. Um, I remember one time, and this is really disgusting, but I remember one time I was, I was um, playing with my dad when I was like really little. I was like seven or eight years old. And I came up and jumped on him and jumped in his lap and he went... And I was like, what's wrong, Dad? He's like, you hit me in the nuts. And I was like, so, what's that? You know, like, I didn't, you know, I didn't get what was wrong. Um, and his face turned bright red, and he was just like, <laughs> and, um, and, uh, little did I know, I'd hit my dad in the nuts with my knee, but I jumped on him, because, you know, I didn't mean to, and he didn't really deserve it, but, um, and then, you know, from the movies, you see chicks hitting guys in the nuts in the movies or kneeing guys in the nuts in the movies all the time. Like, girls get their revenge, they're pissed off at a dude for being a dickhead, and they come right up and they knee him in the nuts. That's our, that's our way of kicking guys' asses. You can't, you can't beat up a guy, so knee him in the nuts. Um, and then, of course, for my ex-husband, that was my way of when he pissed me off, that's how I got him back. And he knew it was coming sometimes. When he pissed me off, he knew I was going to pop him or flick him right in the nuts. And he would, would be walking around or sitting down and he'd start to get kind of antsy and nervous because he'd know he was about to be hurting. So that's pretty much it. Um, I, there's really, it's not a great way, of, there's no perfect way to explain why women like to hit guys in the nuts. It's just, they're so vulnerable and helpless when it comes to their nuts. It's, you know, it's the body part that you, you pretty much make kids with for the most part. I mean, I know there's more to it than that, but they're so vulnerable there. It's just, you know, their organs are on the outside of their body, whereas ours are on the inside of our body. And it's like, ha ha, ha ha ha, ha 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 ha, I can kick you in the nuts. I can kick you square in the nuts. So anyways, uh, yeah, basically when it comes to, um, when it comes to that area, men become total pussies, sad to say. Sorry guys, but we do like to hit you in the nuts when you deserve it.